Hello and welcome back. Uh, do I clear these enemies? Nah, I don't think I get anything for doing so. I could level up, but there'll be plenty of enemies to come. But now, we're going to keep up with the Palace of Shadow. And if I recall correctly, I know how this puzzle is. You just have to walk through the doors that have a fire next to them. I think you do this three or five times. I don't remember which one. And it leads you to the next area. Oh, same door again. Cool. Now we're up here. And now we gotta go backwards. Interesting. Looks like it's five times. Maybe more. We'll see. There's always a magic number. Now we go here. <laughs> that was lucky. Come on. Okay, it's not five or six times. What the hell? Seven? Is it seven times for seven crystal stars? Yes. Yes, it is. And now we're in this weird looking area. It's quite interesting. It's like all water and stuff. It's huge. It's like an underground city. What is this place? Yeah, a mythical place with like so much going on with it to blow that up get the switch we're gonna need to do this sooner than later anyway was that always that fast i don't even remember i played this game in 2021 yes i think it was 2021 and now let's take care of this shit i i hit the Button. The music reminds me of Twilight Town. Yes, yeah, Twilight Town music. Chain Chomp. See, this one's the Chain Chomp, which is originally black. Hmm. No fire, no ice. Lots of bloody defense. Alright, that makes two. And now we'll take a look at that place real quick. Ah, yes. This beautiful place. We got some riddles to solve, friend. Or do we? I can't get through the doors. Maybe the riddles only activate after I do something like i know i kind of know what to do here oh yeah i think i have to mm, okay i'm just gonna double check real quick but yeah did i have the same problem the first time around it's entirely possible yeah so we need to get something for this pedestal yeah it's weird it's a puzzle it's totally huge what do you think yeah it's a puzzle we need to get that from something and once we get that something from that other something we can come back here and do all the puzzles. Oh, yes. And then we got this music. Hello there. And the music doesn't change. So, in that one area, with the chain chomps, they have the twilight music, I think. But anyway, a dark wizard. It's just magic with defense and attack. Pretty powerful enemy. But there's another version of this enemy that I'm more scared of in the Pit of 100 Trials. Well, this guy's a chump in comparison. Ooh, but that chump got me a level up. Do you know what I'm gonna do? Do you know what I'm gonna level up into? You're never gonna guess. Oh, it's gonna throw you for a loop. You have no idea. That's right. It's... Gotcha, bitch. What an asshole! Okay, I can promise you one thing. That is most likely going to be my last badge power level up. And the only reason why I got it was because I needed to get... This second power plus partner... So that now, we are both plus two and plus two respectively. And trust me, that's going to help a lot later down the road. Not even just for this, but for when I got to run the, inevitably run the Pit of 100 Trials. Oh god. I need to deal with you with Tyrant. Oh look, an inconspicuous save block. You know what I'm going to do? Frog. Froggy? Oh, this is what I'm talking about. It's very dark. Who are you? Oh, hi. Oh, wow. That's what I call attention to detail. No one disturbed me here in eons. Who dares defile this sacred place? Hey, isn't that Hooktail? We totally beat her before. What's she doing back? What? You destroyed my precious younger sister? I wonder why she hadn't written recently. Quaken for your mortals, for I am Gloomtail. I will avenge my sister by taking your lot ears and then gnawing on your bones. And here we go again. Everything tend loves to come back full circle, doesn't it? Whoop. My first fresh meat in ages. Allow me to take my time and toy with you a while. This is different. I don't think this is the same theme as Hooktail. It's different, I think. It's been a hot minute since I've done Hooktail here. But anyway, 
Gloomtail, Hooktail's brother. I see the family resemblance. 80 HP, 8 attack, and 2 defense. This is... Ooh, and Poison Breath. And then throw in other attacks. Watch out for the Mega Breath, because it's gnarly. So basically, you need Vivian for that. And that's what, yeah, Goombella just said. So, normally I would power lift and leave it to, to Goombella, but I'll wait, because I need Vivian. Oh, life hurts. All right, here we go. Oh, I didn't get plus four defense, but that's okay. I got distracted by a Windows notification, so let's just keep it nice and simple. Nice. All right, no fire breath, please. Oof, okay. I need to be careful. I need to finish Gloomtail in the next three turns. Or I'm screwed. And I'm confused. Because of course I am. Of course I am. Of course I am. I thought I guarded it. I saw it coming, too. There we go. The the power of frogs. Do I have anything that... That gets rid of... No, I don't think so, right? What's... What I think is gonna happen, because I'm confused, is I'm gonna, like... Try to switch partners or not switch partners, but like oh God does that that negate the fence? I'm gonna heal Mario before he dies. Uh, let's see uh, How much good question? Yeah, this will do Damn it You are really tough meat my little tasty morsels, but how are you fare against this? Oh my I thought you were just gonna do a charge attack. Also, Vivian's kind of dying too. This ain't good. Okay. Uh, new plan. Uh, new plan is power lift twice. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Uh, only plus three attack this time, but I no no need to fret. The defense is what matters. I will heal next time. Of course, I didn't do anything to Gloomtail. Ow. Jackass. Okay. As much as I'd love to power bounce, I suck. So here we go. Spring jump time. 18 damage. We take those. This is survive next turn and we're good. If I greed, I should win. Good. You are not the easy prey you appear to be. I would never be able to show my face if I was bested by you whelps. So I'll show you the true extent of my power. Yeah. So this is the do or die moment. I have to do this right, or I lose. Here we go. I'm doing it. I'm risking it for the biscuit. Done. Nice. Woo, took a lot of damage there. No, is it true? Can I expire? Yes, you can. Yeah, as you can see, I am not meant to be here. <laughs> I am level 22. I have 30 health and 30 flower power. <laughs> I should... Usually I come here with 50 of each. But, um... Here we are. Because I'm a nidget. But... I I appreciate the challenge, you know? Makes me think. Makes me sweat a little. Because what's a game without a little bit of challenge? A chest. What could it be? Just a dead gloom tail over here. A star stone. Now we can go do that puzzle. One hour later. Alright. Now that we got the Star Stone, we can put it right in here. Watch a nice trippy little animation. And then go and solve a crap ton of riddles. Hope you guys like puzzles. Eight pedestals, eight doors. Or, yeah, have to be eight doors. Now let's see if any of the puzzles have changed. Any of the riddles, to be specific. Because most of them are riddles. Make you use your noggin a little bit. But hey, this is a kid's game originally, right? So it's not that hard. Oh boy, what's the hint? God damn it. I need to read the hint. If I recall correctly, you have to defeat them from weakest to strongest. But I'm not going to take that chance until I read the hint. Because they could have changed something. Let, let, the, let fall the weakest, then build to the strongest. Yeah, so that would not have gone in my favor. So it has to go like this. Okay, one puzzle solved. And a nice little switch appears. And then that switch. Ooh. Nice little music accompanying it. Before there was no music. It just kept going on with the creepy music. And even had like a creepy like darkness effect. One down, eight to go. Oh, at least it shows you which ones you've done. Nice. That was not there in the original. Ah, yes, this one. Where these two rooms are connected. 
this one and the one below it. So as you saw there, I was able to break a block with the Ultra Hammer. However, uh, in order to go down there and break the other blocks, I need to go... Like, I need to basically go up, up and down. And we have this one, which is what? Straight on, straight on, where destroy what lies in your path. Simple enough. Destruction. Yeah, like I said, kid's game puzzle. Some of them are tricky, I won't lie, like the one I was just in. You wouldn't really know what to do there. But just interchange between the two rooms. Next up... The shy one hides their shape, the shy one hides their face. Shy? That's when you get Vivian. You hide. And then... You gotta bonk it before it goes away. Alright, then we have this one. Red switches. Onward, 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 retreat, retreat. So... Three... Two. That is all. <laughs> you know, you're wondering, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, I know. It's honestly as simple as numbers. That's it. The unseen may yet be felt, but he, be it here, be it there. So, flurry. But before you can do anything, you have to kind of like wander around for a bit. Like, see if anything gets in your way. Like right here. Done. This one is... All you see isn't all there be. Touch it to pass through. Oh, simple. Done. <laughs> don't trust Don't trust your eyes. Just go for it. That is all. Run into walls. And now I believe we come down to the last one, which requires me to go up and down the floor a couple times. Because these two rooms are interconnected. Like you see here, this was an unbreakable block if I came here first. But because I went upstairs, it turned into one of these. Now that one is perfectly fine. They both hold their own separate key though. So now that I've broken the respective blocks, I gotta go all the way back up, hit the switch, get my key there. But then break the other block, come back down, get the other key. So I'll see you shortly. So there's one. And this should unlock the other one for me below. Here we are. Yeah, that one's actually a very interesting room, that the two rooms are interconnected. I like that one the most, but it also confused me the most as a kid, because like I said before, I was an idiot when I was a kid. Still I'm an idiot now, just a different kind of idiot. That should be all the keys. Let's go shove them in some pedestals. There we go. Last key. Oh, it's nice and dark. Oh, hello. Stars up in the heavens shone, carrying the lore of the sky, carrying the secrets from on high. By the skill and might engraved in stone, stones to rival the celestial spheres, the seven hewn by a fell hand, feared and far, far and wide across the land, master of shadow, queen of fear. That is... different. I do not remember that wall of text in the original. It's a poem about a particular individual. Wow, it's moving. Oh, oh my. What? Mario's just like flapping his arms like as if he has wings. Whoa. Now it's showing us. Yep. Yeah. So all those hallways we walked through, well now we can't go through those hallways anymore. They are now inaccessible. But in return, now we can go deeper into the palace. Well I said we're gonna go check it out, but I gotta call it a part here. It's getting a little too long. Don't wanna make too too many long parts. So yeah, thank you guys for much for watching. Hit all the buttons that help me. And please be sure to take care of yourselves, alright?